Welcome to Dye Headlines. I'm Sibi Shu. Thank you for joining us. In Malaysia, a fire broke out in Kida, destroying 10 houses and displacing 9 households. Upon learning of the news, three volunteers immediately went there to provide care and emergency cash. I've only taken my ID and mobile phone. I was not able to save the other items because the fire was too big. I did not have time to save my belongings. With the burnt smell in the air, this house was burned so badly that only pillars were left. The fire broke out in Kida. Unfortunately, no one was injured. The fire truck could not enter as the alley is very narrow. The houses are crowded together with the big wind putting out the fire took time. Two houses belong to Indians, two houses belong to Chinese, and six houses belong to Malaysians. Upon learning about a fire disaster, people from all walks of life reach out to affected residents. When we came here, many organizations have already given them food, rice, and cookies. We Tsuji volunteers came to provide care and emergency cash so they can buy what they need. Thank you for helping us with financial aid and efforts. Thank you very much. I'm deeply touched to see Digi volunteers help these affected residents regardless of their ethnicities or religious beliefs. Although the affected residents faced the challenge of rebuilding their lives, city volunteers will accompany them along the way.